Hello everybody, it's me, Matteo, and again I welcome you here in my little RC garage. Thanks for stopping by and watching this video. Today I'm going to show you in an unboxing a new scale crawler. This scale crawler comes from Epsima, a German RC company with a lot of cool RC stuff. It's called CR 3.4 Sherpa. Four colors are available, as you can see on this picture. And on the left side are some key features mentioned. Portal axles, two-speed transmission and the diff lock function. Now let's open the box. It's well packed on an ecological way, without a lot of plastic. Here is a manual and a sticker sheet with additional decals. As you can see, the wheels are not installed in the box. Here in this box is the transmitter. It's a 2.4 GHz pistol transmitter. It has 6 channels to control all the functions via different switches. Here this one for the 2 speed transmission. This one here is to switch the lights on and off. And these buttons here are to lock the diffs. And here under this cover are the trim buttons and endpoint adjustments and also the servo reverse function. Overall, a good looking radio for a ready to run truck. The truck is fixed at the bottom with cable ties. And here we can have a first closer look. Directly we can see how many scale details are on the body. It looks like a cheap Wrangler replica, even it's not named as cheap. From underneath we can see the chassis. Here good visible are the portal axles, the forelink suspension and the drive shafts. The chassis rails are made in metal and also in front a forelink suspension is installed. The steering servo sits on the front axle and the linkage includes a big damper. Also inner fenders are on the chassis to protect the parts from dirt and water and this also improves the scale look. The body holds on the chassis with magnetic holders in front and can be flipped open with a hinge at the rear. The 60M BSC is waterproof and a 550 brushed motor is installed. This is the gear shift servo. And these are the servos to lock the front and rear differential. As you can see here the truck is fully equipped with LED lights, out of the box. But now let's screw the wheels on. The tires have a good realistic pattern and the softness is good. The rims are made in plastic and these screws here indicate these are beadlocks. Oh, looks not bad with the wheels installed, hmm? What I really like are the clear windows, for sure I have to install a driver figure later. The manual explains some details about the truck, a complete build guide and a spare parts list is also included. Now I insert the batteries. The transmitter needs 4 AA batteries. 
and I turn on the power button. Then I put in my 3S LiPo battery. The ESC can handle 2S or 3S LiPos or 5 to 9 cell nickel metal hybrid batteries. I switch on also the car and the steering works. Also you can see the working winkers when turning the wheel. Now I can turn on the lights with this switch. As you can see here are not only the headlights shine, but also the side markers and these small spot lamps and the light bar on the roof. Also at the rear the winkers works. The rear lights. And it have already installed brake lights. So these buttons are for the diff locking function. Also this works fine. And this switch is to change the gear. Also this function works good. Soon I'll go out and test this truck on the trails. An extended review and driving video will also follow. So stay tuned to see this. Subscribe to my channel you haven't already. Thanks for watching and see you next time.